This question will change everything. How much to quit your job right now? All right, y'all, welcome back to another video. For those of y'all that don't know, my cameraman, Robbie, where he's working, we can't really travel and go and do. So I'm about to offer him an offer of a lifetime right here. It's gonna be a big step. Hopefully he takes it. Let's go blindfold Robbie. Okay, boom. I gotta make sure that you can't see me. Yo, yo, he's crazy. Yeah, you definitely can't see, bro. <laughs> he's just vibing. There's the door, boom. Okay, I'll just open the door for you. Get in there. Hey. <laughs> this is my filmer Robbie right here. He's been filming for me for what, like three months now? Any guesses of where we are or what I got you? If I'm using my senses, hearing cars, sounds like we're on a highway. I feel like you're finna just go and leave. Like I'm, I'm gonna dip out right now and leave you? Yeah. You smart, you got that right, bro. You got that right, see ya, bro. Bro, chill. <laughs> you can turn around, take off your blindfold, man. Oh God, I thought I didn't have work today. <laughs> All right, clock in. You know what? Let's cut to the chase. All right, Robbie. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This question will change everything. How much to quit your job right now? Um, probably like a thousand. A thousand? Just open that. You can have what it's in there. Let's go. Let's go. Get that crap out of here, bro. <laughs> Whoa. Just don't, don't even got Benjamin Franklin on it. You brought me all the way out here. You blindfolded me just to give me this little stupid briefcase. On a real note, I ain't paying you, bro. The freak <laughs> you talking about, bro? <laughs> Yo, give me my money. <laughs> Finna call Robbie's work. Oh, Sorry. shoot. Uh, yo. What's up? You know who this is? No. Rob. Uh, what's up, Robbie? I've got offered a better opportunity. And so I'm afraid I'll have to quit. It was a pleasure working with you, dude, but you constantly walked into work stinking, bro. No deodorant. Screw y'all, bro. Screw y'all. Robbie. Chill, chill. <laughs> get brain, get brain. But nah, he for real did call them. We Man. Full time with it. Let's go. We just found. This turtle right in the middle of the way. Like, this is dangerous, bro. So we have to find him a new home. Oh, he's chilling with me, though. Yo, it's like a dinosaur. Timmy, I saved your life, but salutes to you. Bye, Timmy. We saved Timmy. Woo! Doing good. I'm not the best, though. Stuck in traffic, but yeah, been better. Look at this line, bro. We've been stuck here for like 20 minutes and it's added an hour to our road trip. And we're about to get back on the road. Hopefully it isn't too long. Look at this, bro. It goes on and on and on. I'm a prisoner of the highway. Driven on by my restless soul. Call me a prisoner of the highway. Bro, where do you live? I live like two hours away from that address. Bro, no way. I thought you were trolling me. All right, so let me give you a little backstory of what's going on right here. So pretty much this YouTuber Snart, I've known him for like two years or known him pretty much just online. We just planned that I was going to stay at his house that day. Keep in mind, we have been driving for hours and hours and hours. I was exhausted. Pulled up to what I thought was his house in the middle of the night, in the middle of nowhere. And then he hits me with the news that this ain't even his house. I was ready to throw hands with him. <laughs> Dude, I was heated. Bro, whose address is this? Where do you live? Like two hours like west of that address. No way, we just got trolled, bro. But we're in the middle of nowhere. No, I'm just fucking with you. You can come to a friend here. Oh my gosh, I hate this dude. I was about to block this dude. <laughs> The next day, I woke up one time to his dogs just like trampling over me. I was so scared, bro, because they're they're not like little chihuahuas or nothing. They're like big dogs. I'm trying to get up here and take a shower. I can't even get up. Hey, buddy. Oh, we're friends now. Oh, shit. I'm just trying to take a shower, bro. I can't even get up there. Should I just go up there? Yeah, that won't go anywhere. You promise, bro? Yeah. Do I trust the biggest harassing prankster? <laughs> they're not going to bite me, though, right? <laughs> we're out. Stay safe. Little does Snarp know, I actually got him a little gift, a little surprise. He let us stay at his crib, so I feel like we gotta pay him back something and give him a little surprise. It's his big day. It is? Yes, what, sir. What is yes, your sir. big day? Well, he hit 200K. Ooh, yep. W Snarp. Yes, sir. What's your name? Bob. Bob. What's yours? Slade. You're a Jesus follower? I am. 
I am. So am I, baby. Hey, amen. It's going to be 81 next uh, in August. Almost 60 years. Ooh. That's the most important thing. Hey, Lord uh, bless you, buddy. Hey, God bless okay. you too, Bob. If I don't see you here again. I'll see you in heaven. Yes, sir, Bob. It, I'll see you there. Take care. Oh, I love Bob. Man, that kind of makes me sad, bro. I'm going to see Bob again one day. We want to get a custom cake. Is it possible to like, put a photo on there? Day? Is it possible today? Not possible today? Oh, we got a surprise snort. So we got to get the photo and then bring it back and then we'll have the cake done. Dude, we got like a full blown mission right now. All right, let's go, Rob. Come on. Robbie heard on one of the Walmart employees walkie talkie. What'd it say? There's. There's two kids in here with a camera. And bro, we ain't even trying to do nothing wrong. Like, I'm still low-key banned from here for like a year. I'm like secretly in here. Surely we won't get booted. Surely we won't get booted. Surely we won't get booted. Can I have to ask you to leave? Or I can call the police and have you escorted off the bus. I just wanted a cake for my buddy. I, I gotta get this first. Okay. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. We can't even get a cake for the homie. Hey, but we low-key need to get out of here because I am banned from here. If they pull up my photo, it's going to say, Slave Balls, Trespass, <laughs> from every Walmart. So we need to go. <laughs> All right, yo, so we got the cake finally, man. We got kicked out the first Walmart we went to. And I know it looks a little ratchet. You know, it, it melted. It was going to take 24 hours to put like a like an edible photo on there. We just put a normal photo on there. And you can't eat that one. But we, we're in a rush, so it, it's going to be fine, all right? All right, Snarf was supposed to get here like five minutes ago, and he just texted me. His car broke down, bro. Look, it's 99 degrees. So anyways, bro, the cake is melting. I don't know if it's going to last, but we've already went this far, bro. We got to get it to him and help out, bro. Like, ain't no way. It's on the side of the road. The day hits 200K. Maybe the cake will make him feel better, bro. Maybe. <laughs> on the side of the highway, it's crazy. Got a tow truck. Oh, I don't know when it's coming, but. <laughs> I feel bad, but it's like, what do I do, bro? He's stressing. 200k celebration. Let's go. Woo! Take your bite of it. Is it good? Seriously, you take a bite of it. That's not that diet. Mm. It's even better on the side of the highway. Side of the highway makes everything better. Yeah, it really does. So what now, bro? What are you gonna do? I have to wait like 90 minutes for a tow truck. I want another bite. Bro, <laughs> hey, at least you hit 200k though. You gotta think of the positive, bro. There's cake all over your face. Oh shit, it's leaking something. Oh my. It's leaking the oil like crazy. Yeah, you're cooked, bro. Here's your cake, bro. You want another water? If you have one. Yeah, I got you. All right, hold up. Come on. All right, I'm not gonna lie. I completely forgot that I was going to get that water for Snart. I just popped that thing <laughs> like it was mine. To be fair, it had been a really long day, a bunch of traveling. I was not thinking straight. So, Snart, if you're seeing this, I'm sorry, man. Hope you get a water. <laughs> it's kind of a bad time to leave you, but... <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were going to stick around this long. I thought you were going. Yeah, we didn't plan on it either. <laughs> I appreciate you letting us stay. That's also a thank you for that. Thank you for the cake. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> yeah, we'll figure it out. <laughs> this is I'll the like... most random situation. <laughs> I feel so bad leaving them. We're just putting this cake up. All right, we need to go. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? doing a vlog or what? Yeah, we're doing a vlog. Hey, what's up? Yeah. Let me get the pineapple dough with. I do got a question though. Uh, were these made with love? Or they weren't? Yo, let's go. I don't believe her. She said totally. Mmm, <laughs> that pineapple dough whip. Yummy. Oh, nah. Oh, bro, the bug done got in my cup. Oh, my. The vibes, bro. I'll quit yapping for a second and y'all just chill and just like look at the moon. You like that? Yeah? <laughs> It's been a long day of traveling. A lot of stuff went wrong. Seemingly things going wrong after one thing after another. We're here and we're enjoying our time. No matter what you guys are going through throughout your day or throughout your month, or even your year or your life. Just remember that those clouds will pass and the sun's gonna come. Well, it's night right now, hold up. Let me think of a no. no. <laughs> y'all see what I'm saying? Even though it's night right now, better times are to come. So y'all keep y'all's head up. How many fingers am I holding up? I don't know. All right, you can't see me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's just vibing. <laughs> <laughs> 